What's up everybody? I've decided to finally do a blog. This is my first blog of what Trevor thinks about. Now, before we start, just to let you know, this will contain some harsh language. So if you don't like harsh language, click the back button and fuck off. Right, I'll take it still here. Now, today I'm talking about this cockwomble, him. That's right, I'm talking about Donald Trump. Now, I've had a week to think about this because I couldn't bring myself to do it on that first day. But this is what I think. I woke up on Wednesday morning expecting America to have some sense and, in, and voting in Hillary Clinton. I mean, it was a simple enough choice. The stable one or the unstable one. And you went for Trump. I mean, what were you thinking? Huh? I mean, do they have to start giving intelligence tests now when you walk into the polling booths? You know, show you a picture of an arse, an elbow and a question mark. And if they that, you don't get to vote. I mean, come on, people. It wasn't a difficult choice. You know, I know she wasn't the best person in the world. But she was the right person for the world, for the job, you know? I mean, come on. I mean, if someone went up to you in the street and asked you, cake or death, what'd you go for? You go for the obvious one, don't you? You don't go for the suicidal option, which you seem to have gone for. You know, the guy's a racist, he's sexist, he hates disabled people. Now, I may be guilty of those things, but I'm not running for office. I mean, that guy is, you know. Does that mean I can basically go into, go you know, into government because I'm a psychopath, apparently, you know? So why have you allowed that guy in? I mean, what's that guy got to do for you to say no? Is it taking away your pop guns? Because that's the only thing that's important to you people, you know? I mean, the guy wants to build a wall and then get someone else to pay for it. Yeah, I don't see um, Mexico's reaction to that one. Yeah. I mean, for God's sake, people, you are on a wave of destruction. You know, Russia loves him. North Korea loves him. Shouldn't that tell you something? Yeah. That little toad Farage likes him. And that bloke's a nobody. You know, he doesn't even hold office in the British government. He's only a European MP when he bothers to turn up. And yet that little cocksucker is bloody well toading up to Trump. Now, you've got to ask yourself, two racist together. Are you really that crazy? Hmm? You know, I felt... Last Wednesday, like I felt when I woke up to the Brit exit situation, I thought Britain won't be voting somewhere so stupid, and then surprise, surprise, they did. And I thought, America, they won't do something so stupid, and they did. Huh? What are you going to do next day? I mean, what? What were you thinking? You know, I can't believe that you will be so fucking stupid. Anyway, that's enough for me today. So if you like this video, hit the like button. If you didn't like the video, fuck off. If you're new to the channel, hit subscribe and leave a comment down below because my mate Martin wants to read your comments. So maybe I'll have a rant about something else in the future. Until then, see you later.